NCTV 45, the train, anytime on your time. Programming furnished by a grant from Joseph's Supermarket. Special thanks to Joseph's. landing. Hush bet the second. I have to put on my glasses. What? That other guy doesn't fly with his glasses on. He goes in the telephone booth and changes. Good thing I was in the kitchen. I already had my apron and my hat on. You never heard of hot peppers. Or did you never hear of how to make sauce? You know, I, I think you went to the Mr. Standish School of Cooking. Next thing you're going to tell me about these pork chops you put in this and that. and that, What the heck are you talking about? You know, there's a fine, fine ritual that goes on with the people that are like a little Italian. It's called sauce. And you get the sauce and you put it on the macaroni, sometimes ginger hair, sometimes ravioli. Hey, you don't want to discriminate. You know, and then, boom. You have a beautiful meal while you're watching football. Always right for football. And if somebody fumbles, gives you agita, you just got to go up, go to the kitchen, grab another meatball. And uh, you'll be okay. See, you, you haven't figured this out yet. What? You don't know how to make sauce. You've been hanging around Johnny too long. Because him and Doc, you know, they watch and watch. They're in our graduate program. They've watched for so many times. Hopefully, they start to catch on. And Koppel, unless you're rooting for Notre Dame, Anything else isn't going to work. Now, what I'm going to do is show you completely and unequivocally how to make some great sauce. Now, I bet I know you're going to be busy. You're going to be running, watching the TV. And the question is, do we eat at noon or do we eat at five? Or do we hit the microphone like that? Well, this is the easy way to figure it out. You can get and start your sauce in a slow cooker. And then if the game speeds up, all you have to do is transfer it. I'll show you how to do that. You could put it on the stove, cook the angel air, and you're set to go. And if you got these hot peppers, well, you're really set to go. So now, you just sit back, 
relax, and watch another exciting adventure of Cook in the Castle. Hey, this is better than all them superheroes they have on TV. I could be a superhero. Look, I could just put my glass in my apron and go flying off. Well, we'll be right back after this. Newcastle's community television station. This program was provided through funding from Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. A special thanks to Cedars featuring Middle Eastern, Italian, and American cuisine. Well, it's time to make our sauce. We've got some fresh tomatoes that we're going to use to give a little bit of that fresh tomato smell, our puree and our paste. We use Italian sausage to uh, put a little pork in there and we're also going to have meatballs uh, and um, that is in another segment with some ground meat and uh, some eggs, breadcrumb, garlic. Watch the segment. We're going to also use uh, bags because we're going to, it's a busy day and we're going to start it in our crock pot and then transfer it to a pan. Let's take it out. Of course, to start out our sauce, uh, we're going to, in order to save time, I'm going to use a slow cooker to get everything going. Then I'll transfer it to a pot and to the stove just to continue it. But if you slow cook it in a crock pot or you cook it on the stove, which takes all day, it's the same amount of time. So um, let's add our tomato puree and our meat and everything and we'll show you what we got you can see we added our sausage now we have some more to add but i just wanted to give you a little picture and visual taste of what we're doing now we're going to put our meatballs in there now we took and uh, we fried our meatballs because if you do anything else it's just not right we fried our meatballs we placed them in around the sausage. We're going to add some more, more puree and paste, and we'll be ready to go. This program furnished by a grant from Ferone Brothers. Two locations, Newcastle on Mill Street and Wilmington Road in Newcastle. Now, with the tomato puree and the paste and the meat all added, we're going to add a couple fresh tomatoes, just one or two. So it gives it that fresh smell and aroma. 
Too bad you won't have smell of it. You can see the fresh tomato in there. And there's nothing like the great smell of fresh tomatoes. And we're going to put our lid on and uh, we'll see you. It takes about six hours for sauce to cook so that it's, and you cook it low and slow. So about four to six hours, we'll see you. A special thank you to Tuscany Square Restaurant, Wilmington and Mitchell Roads, for providing funding for this program. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Now we've transferred our sauce from our crock pot to our pan. We're going to finish letting it simmer and then we're going to dig in with some angel hair and grated Romano cheese and yes, hot peppers always. Look at the meatballs in there and the sausage. Boy, if you had smell of vision now there's our sauce and meatballs in our pan that we've done and our angel hair we're gonna plate this up and take a look special thanks to little johnny's two downtown who provided funding for this program funding for this program Furnished by Mary's Turner's Day Spa. Wilmington Road, Neshanic Township, Newcastle. There we go. Now, Skola Makadu means macaroni stay, water go. And into our sauces will go. Wait till we plate this up. Oh, if you had smell of vision, you'd be in great shape. And there you go. Sausage, meatballs, angel hair, topped with some fresh one of cheese, and just Italian style with some celery and olives. Something. Come see us at lgkg.com. Now there you go. Easy as easy can get. And now you have your sauce made. 
The nice aroma. There's nothing better than fresh cooked tomatoes. And guess what? You have your angel hair. And whether your team won or lost, you got something good to eat. Now, if you're like Johnny and you try this, the dog maybe has some dog food. But, hey, just ask my man, Ange. My son, there's no leftovers. It's like the extra point. It's good. And, and you know what? With NCTV 45 and Cooking a Castle, we're available anytime on your time. And it's just like I said. You're going to love it. Until next time, bon appetit. Yeah.